Hey guys, so today I had some beauty videos planned and some hair tutorials I wanted to do, but this weekend has just been a shambles. Um, I filmed a hair tutorial yesterday and it won't import to my MacBook, but I figured I would just take a break from doing a tutorial and do a fun little tag. But I was actually tagged by Ingray, which is Miss Glamorazzi, to do the Colors of the Rainbow tag. And it was also tagged by 11th Gorgeous, so thank you girls. I thought it was a cute tag, you know, you just do the Colors of the Rainbow and kind of have products to go with it. We're going to go ahead and get started. And the first color is red. And what I chose for my red product is this Big Sexy Hair Root Pump. I love this stuff. If you want some volume to your hair, this is seriously... I'm making a mess. If you want some volume in your hair, this is definitely the way to go. It gives me so much volume. I'll put this in my roots when my hair is damp, and I'll just blow dry my hair like upside down and to the side, you know, the opposite way um, that the hair, you know, would fall. So it has a lot more volume when it comes down. And I just love it. If you have the chance to try it out, I definitely recommend it. The next color is orange, and I chose my Tarte blush. This is the Amazonian Clay Blush in Tipsy. And it's just a gorgeous kind of coral orange shade. The outside is basically orange, so that's why I chose it. <laughs> but these Amazonian clay blushes are amazing. They last for so long, and they just look really beautiful on the skin. And these blushes are so, so smooth. Now for yellow, I definitely had to pick something with yellow packaging, and I chose my Bahama Mama bronzer from the Balm because this is just an essential for me, and I feel like in the summertime this is going to be great because it's super, super dark, and it's just going to look awesome to contour with, so I've talked about it in a favorites video before, and I just really love it. For green, I chose my Holy Grail hair mask. This is the Macadamia Deep Repair Mask. Love this stuff. Can't get enough of it. It smells so good. It makes your hair feel amazing. I do this at least once a week to my hair. Um, I only wash my hair about two to three times a week, but this definitely goes in one time, and I just love it. It makes my hair so soft, and I feel like I can go more days without washing my hair when I use this product. For blue, I chose the Neutrogena Makeup Remover Wipes. I love these so much. I think they're just amazing. They're not too strong. They don't sting my eyes or anything like that, and they take off all of my makeup, and they just work really well for my sensitive skin. For indigo, I think this is indigo. We'll see. When the light hits it, it looks indigo. I don't know if you can see, but like when I look through the bottle right here, it's definitely indigo. So I chose my Numi Argan Oil. I love this stuff. I mentioned this a lot before, and it's just great. It makes my hair super soft at the ends, and I don't really honestly have many split ends anymore because of the products I've been using, like the Macadamia Deep Repair Max, this, I've been using the It's a Tin, and they've all been re working really well with my hair, so I definitely had to mention this. Next is the color Violet. I think this is Violet. I'm hoping so. It's um, an Essie Nail Polish in Playdate, and it's just a gorgeous purple color. I love this one so much. I think I got it sometime last year, or probably got it this year at some point. I can't remember, but it's just a really pretty purple color, and I always love, love, love this on my nails because it's not too dark and it's not too light. Okay, so the next color after violet is pink and I just had to include this because I use it all the time and it's literally a product I cannot get enough of and it is the Beauty Blenders. I have three now and I just love them so much. I got my first one back, I think it was in November. I did a first impression on it, so if you wanna see that, I'll leave it down below. I think it's just an essential with makeup, especially for the summertime, because it just really makes your foundation go on flawlessly and you don't have to use a lot of product to make it go on and cover very well. So I love the Beauty Blender. It's really rare to find me putting foundation on with a brush. Um, and usually if I am, it's because my beauty blenders are too dirty, which they need to be washed now. And the last one is multicolor. This is the one I was most excited about because I love anything that has different colors and just kind of out there. But this I actually purchased recently. This is the Pure Paradise Beach Bronze Leg Shine. This is from Bath & Body Works. But it smells really good. It's basically like a shine spray. And this is what the product looks like. And all you do... You just spray it on your body. Oh my god. It smells so good. And it just gives you like shimmer. You probably can't see it in the camera, but oh, it smells so good. It just smells like summer. And it's a gorgeous bottle. Just a little bit of sparkle and 
This is definitely going to be my go-to, and it smells amazing. I don't know how many times I can say that. So I hope you guys enjoyed the Colors of the Rainbow tag. This was a fun one for me to do, just mentioning some more of my favorite products. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll tag some people down below to do this. And if you do this tag, feel free to leave it as a video response. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye!